Hi, welcome, Simon here, and I hope you're doing well. In this video, I'll try to remove the hard drive to recover the data. This is a Samsung laptop, and let me identify the model for you. The model here is NP950QED. I think that's the model, it's kind of hard to see. All right, so the computer is Samsung. Let's remove the hard drive. And I'll be using the, hopefully it's an M.2 drive. I'm not sure what kind of hard drive is running. And if it's, and if it's M.2 SSD, then I have this USB adapter where I can insert the M.2 like such and to recover the data. Okay, so let's go ahead and remove the back cover. There are hidden screw right underneath the rubber. So you gotta remove those four rubber stopper. This is just a regular metal prying tool, nothing special. Go underneath, remove that. I'll be using a Phillips screwdriver. Let's try to use a Phillips 1.5. The other screwdriver is a lot much bigger. So this is the uh, Phillips 1.5. It looks like the screw doesn't come off and it just kind of uh, stay there in the case except the one at the bottom. All right, the bottom one, the bottom screw comes off, but the one on the top does not. Okay, the next step is to go in between that metal bracket here to see if I can pry it open. Okay, so the entire back cover will just come right off and you're going to hear a little bit clicking noise which is normal because the uh, back cover they kind of run on the rivets that clip onto to the base on the laptop so when you remove it there's going to be a little bit of a cracking sound to that all right straight away i can identify that the m.2 hard drive is here and that little piece right there is to um probably a, a, a heat conductor or maybe to prevent any static coming from the the bottom of the computer to short off the hard drive so this is probably something heat conductor mat or um, static I think all right let's jump right into it Phillips screwdriver again and remove the screw and then slide the M.2 to the right to remove it. I'll be using this USB adapter. Slide it in. And I'll plug it into a different computer to try to recover the data. All right, that's pretty much it. That's my goal is to re re retrieve the data and then retire the laptop. So the laptop is pretty much straightforward. You can see that the battery is here, the motherboard, the CPU, it looks like the RAM is embedded to the computer, so it's not upgradable. That's what it looks like to me. And this is probably a secondary M.2 you can upgrade to, but the mini version, the small one. All right, if you do find the video is helpful, please smash the like button for me. And if you have any question, comment down below, and I'll try to answer you. Until next time, take care and bye now.